So finally, we were able to <laughs> get inside. This is Neprazi Museum Museum Ban. It's a Hungarian word which means um, ah, I don't know exactly what it means. They have a good shop over here, Ethno Shop. I think it's like Ethnography Museum, something like that. Uh, here, like what I've said earlier, um, the architect should be should be good enough to manage how to design the ceiling because there's a lot of dead areas dead space um, because of the shape of the structure but it needs to be designed surprisingly it's got a very artistic design and uh, the architect or whoever the interior designer uh, was able to you know make it this way super amazing and um, I think there's also a mini library over here let's try to get inside this is like a mini library it's all Hungarian for sure because of course they're promoting their culture and there's also spaces over here if you want to study group study this is a perfect place, very silent. I think there's no need to be. Okay. I think it's all Hungarian, so we are not going to explore that much. It's just a library. And I want to show you something over here. I don't know if this is a their one of their traditional clothes, but it says here it's a digital remix so if it's a digital remix most probably it's like a combination of modern clothes most probably they have adopted like um, a friendly material to incorporate on their um, uh, cultural traditions when it comes to clothing uh -huh. and the ceiling is like of course you, you would expect it sloping down because of the shape of the parabola up as I've seen I, I've, I've shown you earlier and that's it it's beautiful I think I want to show you something else as well this is a collections beautiful collections which most likely represents their culture because you can see there are some symbols of the design, different shapes, amazing shapes, and some of uh, what do you call this? Like bottles, and they've got also like thorns, thorns of I don't know what kind of thorns is that, and uh, yeah, and some uh, how do you call this? Ornaments. Yeah, and they've got there in in the in the other side like umbrella bottles. I think this is just for display. Anyway, let's move down. There's a small cafe over there. It's a perfect place when you want to have some rest. Then you can go there and take some sip of coffee, tea, whatever. Then here you can sit also here if you want. If you sit here, you can have an, uh, you can you you can have a look on a big screen over there, and there are the the the, the, the videos here are like um, stuff they are promoting, most likely like shoes, bags, plates. It's very clothes. Most of them are clothes, and here comes stair going down all right wow that's the highlight part the pots and in most countries they have their own jars pots plates and all all how do you say this old jars which um, are made of 
maybe different materials most likely clay wow. so beautiful amazing we will try to have a look on them closer find here um, I'm not really familiar with their history but as you can see here their I think by by these things over here it reflects how rich their culture is because you'll find some old ornaments I'm overwhelmed to be honest. It's, it's all like that over there.